Crystal Thomas was born the first of five children to Victor and Natalie Thomas. Just months before her 12th birthday, tragedy struck, and the words simple and normal described anything but her life. The day started off like any normal day. My dad always took me to school. You know, I thought he was going to go to work and I was going to see him again that day. But my mom picked me up and then eventually we make it back to my house and there's all these media cameras in the driveway and all of our neighbors are outside and all these cop cars are in the driveway and I'm like, what is going on? And so we walk in and my mom tells us that my father had been incarcerated. I went from being an 11 year old kid to an 11 year old adult almost overnight. But just a few months later, the family needed her more than ever. She sat us down in the same living room in the same spot that she just had three months ago when she told us about our father being incarcerated. And she told us that she had stage four breast cancer. This can't be real. You know, this has to be a night where when I wake up, you know, life will be back to how it was. Basketball for me was the one place that I knew if I was mad, I could be mad. If I was sad, I could kind of transfer the sadness into energy on the court. If I was happy, I could just go out there and enjoy playing basketball. She became the second player to ever record 300 rebounds in a season and ranked second in career blocks in school history. Crystal finished her senior year in record-breaking fashion and was drafted in 2011 by the Seattle Storm and has since played for the Phoenix Mercury and overseas for teams in France, China and Spain. Since she was 11 years old, Crystal has faced many hardships most have never endured. But not only has she turned tragedy into triumph, she set an unforgettable example with her compassionate character and unshakable faith. Because it's not just a thing. Like for me, it's my life.